Whether you're diving in or climbing out, pools and showers go hand in hand. But in the city of Eugene, thousands of people use the showers without ever taking a swim. One of the services that our pools have always provided is the option for people to come and take a drop-in shower. For 50 cents, anybody can take a shower at Sheldon, Echo Hollow, or Amazon Pools, whether you're swimming or not. You don't need to sign in, you don't need an ID, and you won't show up on the lobby's security cameras, because there aren't any. There's no way to know when somebody comes in, who they are, or when they leave, or if they stay all day. Shauna Daughters came face to face with a thief at the Sheldon Pool last month while taking her 12-year-old for a swim. Shauna tried to stop the unidentified woman from leaving with her bag, but there was no one to help. Theft is just a petty crime, but the main concern is that there's just a growing number of IV needle users in the community and MRSA and mental illness. So far this year, Eugene police have responded to 70 calls for service at the three pools or the surrounding areas. Harassment, illegal camping, theft, animal cruelty, assault, indecent exposure. One victim told us his bag was stolen from inside the shower just nine feet away. We see this as a benefit that we can provide to the community and so we're going to provide it. I don't believe we've ever had any problems. To be sure, the showers are greatly appreciated by some in the homeless community. Mary and John Howe, who've been homeless in Eugene for two months, were headed for the showers at the Echo Hollow Pool. Everybody wants to have a shower every once in a while, so, you know, I mean, just being clean means, you know, being healthy, too. Daughter says it's the hours that worry her most. She says she'll never drop her child off at Sheldon by herself. It is an opportunity for anyone to go in there and whether it's predatory, whether it's just to take a shower. In Eugene, Bob Schaefer, KEZI 9 News.